Hey everybody, it's MarioFan27 here, back with some more Pokemon Blue. In, in the last episode, which was the finale of the series, we took out, we took on Gary and entered the Pokemon Hall of Fame. In this episode, you might not the cave entrance here earlier in the game. That's right to my, to the left of the screen, technically in front of me. I don't know, actually technically to my right. Now it's in front of me, now it's... To my left and behind me, I don't know. Now, enough with perspective to this little character in the game. That last time we, we took on Gary and entered the Hall of Fame. In this episode. So, we, we, we're going to be going one thing that opens up after you enter the Hall of Fame. And you might notice my team is higher leveled. Because there's some decently powerful Pokemon where we're heading. And, like, I think there's... At, like at most, random counters level 67, so I wanted to go ahead and alleviate the problem by using some rare candy. I used rare candy to get my Pokemon up to level 70. So we will not have to deal with that. I believe there's actually a trainer over here. I believe there is a trainer over here. Can't get my mushroom Pokemon. Okay. This is one way in which you can actually get back over the ledge without going through Mount Moon. Get get sir. Dang it, I believe you have to have surf by this point in the game to beat the champion. Now you need another Paris. Got an ice beam. Okay. Hey, let's get a Paris back. They're not completely useless. useless. Okay. Yep, I knew I would not be getting leveling up because I'm like level 70. I need to have enough for candy to get my Pokemon to level 100. Anyway, cave entrance. Welcome to the unknown dungeon. Or, unknown dungeon. Cerulean cave goes under its third two names. All 67 Pokemon here. This is extremely powerful. Extremely powerful Pokemon lie here. If you ever need to do any training whatsoever, this is the place to do it. This is like... It's... <coughs> <coughs> Only Pokemon League champions are allowed to enter here. Thought you were thinking by the, po by the League. And since we beat them last time, we can head in here. Hold on, I'm just gonna probably ride my bike. TV up, like I need it. I think I just gotta make like two stacks in my inventory. The last time, whenever I picked up a glitch item, I don't know, it didn't. I forgot if you used it, so it's down to a regular item's count. No, I doubt you'll get 59 PP ups in the actual game by playing it legit. And it brought me back here. But I don't feel like surfing, I need to kind of backtrack this way. Because I'm lazy and I don't feel like opening a menu up. When I would have to anyway to surf. Yeah, it was fast to get to surf. Good thing in Gen 1, I can actually interact with things when I'm surfing. Max Elixir. Hold effect walk. Put that back up, because. Bad stuff. See now, yep, two stacks of Max Elixirs. Whenever you pick up a glitched item, it just seems like it always gives you two stacks. If you pick up an item that you already have, 
good job. Like, if we find another map, the ball laying on the ground, I'm gonna to attack them, but there's only one. Nugget. Stand by Pokeballs, because you're gonna wanna have Pokeballs. A lot of Pokeballs. Or your Master Ball. Or Master Balls. I just did the repel, didn't I? Hey, did I not? That's how you do a repel. Then one just show a little 51 venom off wouldn't just show up if I hadn't didn't have a repel up. You see all 50 Pokemon here. Both door. But only you could like come here like before the Elite Four and train, because this is a good spot. Like these are the po like well, they have Pokemon here at bubble that I would want to train at. Where to go? Then this place. There's a lot of useless dead ends here, although this is not one of them. This is actually where I'm supposed to go, but I want item. Give me item. Fourth door. Let's loop me around. So I could have just done that. I think it. I think that looks bad. Is that one tile that I got that I think Max Elixir on? Wait, what you're doing nowadays? What you like? Your propel effect wore off. Would you like to use another one? Yes. Please, I don't want to encounter Pokemon that I can kill in one hit. Cause I have power glitches. I mean, I'm. I, Incredibly powerful trainer. The useless glitch. Yep, useless dead ends everywhere in this place. I think we are just about there. I think this is the end. I am Ultra Ball. I think that might be the way we're supposed to go, in that water. I don't know. It's been a while since I played Unknown Dungeon on the Game Boy games. Or I have before. But it's been a while. Item. Max Survive. How are my glitch stacks work working? I have three stacks of Max Survives. 99, 99, 29. Which much? <laughs> and if I wanted to, I could duplicate that nugget and you'd get a ton, a ton of money. You can't do that. You have to glitch. Yep, this does look like it's the way I put to go. And I feel like I don't think I have. Wait, I have dig. Good. I I feel like I've got an escape rope, but I, I have dig, so I'm good. Keep going. I think we just got there. You gotta be kidding me. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm coming back a little early because I I remembered something about this place. The original Unknown Dungeon Pokemon and Green was actually different. They changed it because they I think they thought it would be too hard for us Americans over here. Uh, point blank, this place has had a lot of changes in its design. And one thing that Nintendo forgot to do when they changed over design, <laughs> they forgot to make it so you can't walk on these. So yep, you can just sit here. And it doesn't do anything. Like this tile I'm dating, I'm on right now is the same as the one I'm on now. These two are the same, so I can walk on them. So kind of funny. They didn't put like, I don't know, whatever they have to do to make it not work. And that was like really close to like where we just where, where I left off and I accidentally dug out of here. And I ended up resetting this and I learned I ended up resetting because I accidentally fought some the trainer that I wanted to save for the, the glitch episode. Speaking of glitch up I so I we, so I set it up again to get more red candies and I learned and I was saying earlier in this episode it's a good place to train up only this was open before the Pokemon League. No, just 
you'd glitch train it. If you'd missing though. If you the the glitches, you have one like level 160 Pokemon. Then again, you can get duplicate rare candies. Anyway, this is our prize. Mew. No, it's not Mew, but Mewtwo. The the original overpowered Pokemon. To just see how well we can stand up to it. To get to the point of dying, I'm <laughs> get to the point of dying. It recovers. I'm not gonna fool around with them too much because I have Master Balls. And two Ultra Balls. Did I, if I actually end up killing him because I want not use Okay, that's not killing. That's that's critical damage. Hey, I got all five hits. And I hope I don't next time. Well, yeah, he's gonna live. Or die. Oh god. Don't. Yes! Perfect. Now I wanna see if I can actually catch him with my two Ultra Balls I have. That'd be neat. Good job, Eevee. You exactly got the number I wanted. That's a net Houdini said it's like type in with sand, it's like glass. Pretty good. Okay, sure. Sure, buddy. Nope, missed. Missed both of them, dang it. Man, we might as well just quit fooling around with this guy. Go master ball. You two is caught. You two, the genetic Pokemon. Six foot seven, two hundred and sixty nine pounds, are created by a, a scientist that has to use horrific gene gene placing and DNA engineering experiments. I like how you have one scientist, like a scientist. But anyway, since we've done that, that's really it for this game. I know, it went by just super fast. Anyway, I briefly touched on this at the end of the last episode, but what's next? What's left since we. since. What's left? Well, what are we doing next after this? Like, what are we doing after this? Well, after this, there's gonna be one more episode for the time being, and it's going to be a Pokedex episode. That, po that episode is going out in two days, just like typical schedule. I believe 22nd, I believe it was supposed to be 24th, but Elite Four was all crammed to one episode. When I saw it, it would be two. So there are going to be a Pokedex episode consisting of all the bios that we made, and I like how the Max Appel symbol just a black square. So we're going to have. We're going to have a video of. We're going to have a, a video of a poke, of the Pokedex, and then and then I'm going to eventually make a make a return to this for a, a glitch episode. But I don't know when that's going to be. Probably sometime over the summer or in fall. I don't know. Probably summer or fall 20, 2016. Don't know when I'm going to do that. Hope sometime then, because there are quite a few glitches in the game. Now it's probably going to be a long episode. Heck, it might be even be blend into a couple episodes. And, and then, and then April in just a few days, Super Mario Galaxy is going to make its long-awaited return to the channel. That that series started last October, and it just sorry for it. It just received so many interruptions in it. And then I, I, I planned to just revive it and Smash Bros at the same time, but I just did Smash Bros and then jumped into Pokemon. Hoping to do both them at the same time, but no. Pokemon turned to an every other day series, and now it's it. So after that, the Galaxy, and eventually, I think I'm predicting, I'm thinking that it's probably going to be LP number 10, but as now, LP number 10 is going to be Pokemon Yellow. 
by joining back into the world of Kanto. To test out some stuff for some new formats for Pokemon LPs. Now anyway, as you see me leveling up my Pokemon all the way to level 100. Oh, and I want to mention, after the glitch, there's, there are going to be some battles. Don't know when these are going to come out, some point after the series. But there will be battles with my friends and people. There will be battles. Anyway, as I'm leveling up my Pokemon to level 100, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Join me back here in April for the return of Super Smash, for, of Super Mario Galaxy. See you guys then.